Okay, we are in for a treat this morning because we have rounded up some of the best holiday cocktails for you this morning from some of the hottest hot spots around San Diego. And here to show us what we've got is mixologist Erin Williams of Hush Cocktails. And she's gonna tell us how we can make some of these drinks skinny without compromising all of the delicious flavor that we love. Good morning to you, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. All right, first of all, what are some simple ways people at home can switch out their drinks and still get a, a really good taste and a fun cocktail, but not have all the calories that come along with it? There's a couple of different ways to do that. Um, one of them is uh, an example is the blood orange Hito, in which we use a low calorie liqueur, I really like Cointreau, okay. um, and wine rather than rum so that there's fewer calories in the wine and you can still have a full cocktail. Very uh, smart. So you're going to make that for us right now? Yeah. Okay, um, cool. It's actually prepped to be made. Very good. Um, so all we need to do is add a little bit of ice to this. And this one's from, where's this one from again? This one is a Hush Cocktails. Uh, Hush Cocktail. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. It's a, is this a popular drink? It is a very popular drink. If you want to go oh, ahead yeah, and shake absolutely. that. Absolutely. <laughs> yep. A little bit harder, a little bit harder. Oh. You got to really just get into it, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you said this guy has tangerine in it? Yes, it has Satsuma tangerine, which awesome. is in season right now. It's a great winter citrus fruit. Okay. Um, and then all you're going to do is strain it off into any type of glass, really. And you could top it off for, with club soda oh, if you want it a little bit is. lighter. Um, but this is only uh, about 125 calories. Awesome. Give it a nice little orange twist. Look at how festive that looks, too. I love yeah, the colors in it. That's nice beautiful. nice green flecks of mint. Very nice. Um, one of my favorite, favorite drinks of all time, uh, something that I made holiday with um, Cointreau that's infused with uh, fresh cranberry sauce. So okay. you just leave the fresh cranberry sauce in the Cointreau in a little vessel on its own overnight and okay. then strain out the cranberry juice um, so that it's fully infused. Ooh, Ooh cheers. Look at that. I love it. <laughs> love the sound of that um, morning. <laughs> this is... Uh, is this from Hush Cocktails as this well? This is a Hush Cocktails specialty. Yeah. Okay. This is one of my favorite holiday drinks. Um, and oh then we're today we're is. using Yellowtail uh, Bubbles, which is a new product that has this great thing about it called a Zork, which I love because I like to make cocktails with it the next day if you don't finish a bottle of champagne. Right. And this little thing that went flying somewhere um, will reseal. And you can put it back on. And you can put it back on. Get out. Yeah. I haven't seen that before. Isn't That's that amazing? so clever. Look, you just stick it back on, and hopefully it won't bust an eye out. But... Um, Stick it back on, and then it'll keep it. Uh, I have never seen that before. That's oh, here we really, go. Really, really clever. You gotta open it and then put it back on. There and you then go. It's totally sealed. And so you don't have to finish the entire bottle. Right. The night. So it keeps it Genius. fresh. Yes. Love that. Yeah. And this is all you do with this one. That's all you do with it, and it's really simple. Do you want to taste? Oh, that it's looks really, great. really simple. This looks like a really good um, New Year's Eve drink. It's a too. great New Year's Eve drink. It's a great Christmas Eve drink. Um, you can add a little bit of bitters to it if you don't like it so sweet. But just the cranberry infused quantity you can garnish it with a little fresh cranberry Cute. or a little craisin. It's okay. Really speaking of Christmas Eve, this is uh, we have, we're trying uh, Noche Buena, 105, 105 calories. What 105 is that exactly? Calories. Oh, and that is less than 100 calories. This is that is Champagne's only way about to go. 96 calories. Very very it is. smart. Uh, Champagne only has about 90 calories per glass. These are some so. serious blocks of ice, by the way. Are you seeing this? <laughs> These are like the largest ice cubes I've ever seen ever. <laughs> And okay. this, is a, this is a really fun cocktail. We're using um, Fortaleza Repo Sado Tequila. Okay. But we've infused it with cinnamon. It's really easy to do at home. You just put it in a little bottle with a stick of cinnamon overnight. For a full bottle, I use about five sticks of cinnamon. Okay. And then you're just going to throw about an ounce and a half of cinnamon-infused tequila. Look at that. Into your glass. And it's really easy. Cinnamon-infused. Yeah. I love that. I haven't even heard of that before. That's really cool. And then you're going to want to take... Agave nectar, which is a great low calorie sweetener, and you want to use about a teaspoon of agave nectar to sweeten it up, and then a little bit of fresh lime juice, just about half, juice about half a lime. Each uh, lime that um, a whole lime yields about an ounce of juice, so okay. about half an ounce of lime juice. Very good. And then uh, just a dash of bitters in okay. there. 
just to brighten it up a little bit. And then what I did was I made cinnamon infused club soda. Oh. So all the flavor with none of the calories. Very smart. And so I make it all the... that full taste. Right. But you're not getting all the calories. That's exactly. really, really smart. And then just want to add a tiny splash of sugar free, unfiltered apple cider. You can fresh press it at home with a, you know, a handy juicer or whatnot. And then this. You will just dust a little bit of fresh cinnamon on top to make it nice and festive and Look give it a that. great nose. I love that. So you've got okay. a hint of the cinnamon, but it's not overpowering, right. huh? Mm -hmm. And then real quickly, we only have about 20 seconds left, but I want to get to the skinny margarita. This is from uh, Maria, Maria Maria. Maria Maria does a skinny margarita. Awesome. With, um, they use agave nectar. Is that this right here? That's this one over here. Oh, the far one. Okay, right. very good. And fresh so that's fewer calories Using fresh as well. lime juice instead of a bottled mixer always cuts the calories. A normal margarita without fresh juice will run about 750 to 800 calories. With fresh lime, it runs from about like 175 to 250 Clever. calories. So using fresh juice as a mixer and just adding a tiny bit of agave nectar or, you know, a low calorie sweetener of some sort really makes a difference. Awesome. And you could probably just ask the restaurant to do that for oh, you. Oh, absolutely. Just switch it out. Just say you only want fresh really, juice. Really, really smart. You don't want sour mix. Erin, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We got through a lot. We had a lot yeah, to we get did. through. Very good. <laughs> and you're with Hush Cocktails, Hush cocktails. once again. Yeah. Yes, yeah. you can find these recipes on our website, www.hushcocktails.com. Awesome. Cheers. Okay, where's yours? You grab, you have like cheers. 18 to I choose know. from. We could, we could totally <laughs> we'll double, double fist, fist right there now. We there go. we go. Double cheers. fist. Cheers. There we go. Okay, back to you guys now. <laughs> Enjoy, Erica.